Oh my gosh, what do you have? What is that? The Iowa. Okay, yeah, alright. And there it is, yep, I'm sinking. That's it. It's all over. <laughs> Alright, we're back in Tiny Sailor's World, and today we're checking out the Christmas event update. So yeah guys, let's get into the video. Now before I get started, let's take a look at the event, and it looks like it's pretty much the same as the last ones, except instead of pumpkins or turkeys, we're just collecting snowmen. And along with that, we have to collect a rare, or legendary, or a divine treasure chest. So that can come in blue, purple, or gold. So, with that done, let's go ahead and let's get started. Now, I'm not doing this alone, I'll be joined by Jay Killen, so, yeah, we're sort of gonna race him to see who will be able to finish the event first. Now, I've actually got a question for you, Jay Killen. Have you been able to collect anything so far? Yeah, so far I've gotten two snowmen, and it seems that after I collected them, immediately after I get hit by, like, a torpedo or I hit a mine, and after I collected the second one, I basically ended up hitting, like, three torpedoes at this point. I'm down to, like, almost 1,500 health. Are you in the SS United States? Uh, no, I'm actually in the Queen Mary because in light of the update that the Queen Mary has actually reopened to the public as of recently. Alright, so I'm looking around New York and so far I haven't really seen anything. I guess I'll just follow the shipping lane and see where this takes me. Oh, hello! I see you. Yeah, I'm trying to limp back over to New York as I'm kind of low in the water. Oh, yikes. So. I'm assuming you found the uh, snowman over here, right? Somewhere over there, yeah. Now that tells me I should not look over here, because if you collected them already, then, uh, yeah, I won't be able to see them. So, I'm just gonna turn this way and see where it takes me. You know, it also would be good using the binoculars, especially night vision, that would help out a lot. Look at that. I mean, I don't see any snowmen, but it is working pretty good. Oh, there's one! There we go! Alright, so, there we go! I found a purple glowing chest. Oh, actually, I think that would be one of the chests that you need to collect. So, yeah, I would recommend getting that. And I also see another snowman right over there. So I'm going to stop the ship right over here. And there we go. So now I'll just grab it with, uh, well, with my character here, which is invisible. So there we go. We got it. Now we've got two down and uh, three to go. And also, I got to grab a chest. Yeah, just earlier, I got hit by another thing i think it was a torpedo because it was directly on my side i don't know why i keep on getting targeted like i've hit like four or five things so far that is really unfortunate because i mean you were just mentioning the queen mary just reopened and now it's been torpedoed and also you've hit a mine right so uh, i think so yeah luckily yeah. i just spotted my third snowman well that's good for you unfortunately for me i've only got two and i don't even have a chest was that chest actually one that you could use for the mission or the event? Uh, I assume so. I mean, it just kind of spewed out like Christmas tree sparkles pretty much. So yeah, that is one for the event. So you did get that. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to keep my eyes out for another snowman. I've got to collect three more and then a chest and then I should be good. But right now it's a pretty close race. Are you heading back to wherever you came from to repair? Uh, I might try and limp to Halifax, but luckily after I collected this third snowman, I didn't get hit by anything. Oh, that's good. All right, I am approaching Tokyo, and I don't see any snowmen yet. I do also see these random floating boxes. I'm not sure what those are. What the heck? Uh-oh. Well, I just struck something. I'm not sure what it was. It may have been a mine, but luckily... The SS Gillette 3 is holding its all right now, and I'm going to close the watertight doors because, uh, yeah, I don't want to flood and sink. I can see so many mines around me. I'm actually going to start looking under the water so I don't hit any. Yeah, that's a really good idea because, I mean, obviously, it seems like if you strike another one, you're going to go down, right? Yep, and speaking of, I just found a fourth snowman. Oh, wow, so it seems like you need one more snowman, and actually... Speaking about snowmen, I just found two. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this one here, and then I'll grab the other one, and there we go. I think, yeah, all I need is two more. So after this one, that's it. I am good with the snowman. Then I just need to find a chest, and look at that, there's another one. So yeah, it seems like if you really wanna get through this event pretty quick, just go to Tokyo. It seems like that's where all the snowmen are gathering. I'm not sure how that works, but there we go. So once I grab this one, I'm going to look for the chest, and I'm going to do that by flying over the islands. Once I find one, then I'm going to sail to it and then grab it. 
So that seems like a pretty easy way of getting the chests. Now, if you're wondering, I can't just jump out of the plane because it doesn't allow me to do that, but here we go, the last snowman, and there it is. So let me go ahead and spawn in the plane and take a look for the chest. I see my final snowman. Really? Where's that? Yeah. Um, in between Southampton and Cherbourg. Oh, okay. So is it sort of in the channel or near an island? Uh, it's near like an island. Um, there's actually many islands uh, around it. It's like these small ones, and then there's like a big volcano mountain one. And then another kind of channel looking area, like a long island and a small island. So, yep, I just got it. Congratulations! So you'll be the first to take a look at the event ship, and I'll have to get to it in a moment. But right now, I'm actually looking on the page where all the new vehicles were added. So we've got a new aircraft, we've got a new sailing ship, and then we've got a new ocean liner. So we've got the Fairy Swordfish, the Constitution, and then... I'm not sure how you pronounce that, but it looks like an Italian liner. Let's actually take a look. Yeah, it is. It is an Italian ocean liner built in 1932. So that is pretty cool. But anyways, let me go ahead and spawn in the swordfish and we'll sort of fly it around and look for the chest. All right, so let's take a look at some of these land masses over here. Usually this is where you'll actually find the chests. So yeah, let's take a look. We'll fly low. I don't see anything. Oh, there's something. That actually might be it. So yeah, it's actually not too far from New York. So actually, let me go ahead and crash the plane. There we go. I'll spawn in a ship, sail over there, and then get it. All right, I'm going to set sail in the SS Gillette 3, and we're going to see if we can find that chest. So it should be near an island. I'm not sure if it's this one over here. I think it's actually one that's over this way. So we'll go this way. Yep, this is the one. So let's go ahead. Let's stop the ship just over here. I'll hop on the land and sort of just walk over to it, and we'll see if that chest is the right one. It should be because it's gold, but we will find out. All right, here it is. Moment of truth. Is it the right chest? Here we go. And yes, it is. There we go. So I've just won the Christmas event. So there we are. That is actually pretty cool. All right, so here we have the Quinta de Savoia, the event ship, and it looks really, really cool. It's a really well-balanced ship, and it kind of reminds me of the SS America. And I say that because of the superstructure and the bow. It sort of just looks like that. And also, sort of the general overall shape of the ship. But it is definitely an Italian ship. You can see with the colors and sort of the design as well there. Also reminds me of the racks. But uh, yeah, there we go. And look at that. It's the Constitution. What are you doing, Jay Killen? Mm, nothing. Oh boy. Yeah, I see what's about to happen here. So we're about to watch you fire cannons, I believe. Yep, here we go. This is it. And yep, you are doing absolutely nothing to me. And it's probably because I don't have PvP on. Oh, there we go. Yep, that was a mistake. Move. Probably some broken portholes and some dents in the hull, maybe. But uh, yeah, this ship also has interior. It is really impressive. With all of these new ships, you get to see some more interior. And that is always awesome, especially when you go into mini mode and actually explore the ship. That is pretty cool too, and we'll be doing that in sinking mode as well. So when I sink the ship, I'll go into mini mode and walk around, so that'll be cool. Oh my gosh, what do you have? What is that? The Iowa. Okay, yeah, all right. And there it is, yep, I'm sinking. That's it, it's all over. All right, so here I am in tiny mode, or well, mini mode, and you can see the ship is starting to list over to the port side, which is not good. And inside the ship, as you can see, it's uh, also not looking good because it's also tipping. And um, yeah, you can imagine all the furniture sliding and whatnot. Now, I also got a lot of requests to go into first person. And when I go into first person, this is it. So the camera's sort of above my head. I can't do much about it. But yeah, the ship is not looking good at this stage. Here we are in the promenade looking out. And uh, there he is. He's circling. And yeah, the ship is... Oh, I actually fell. I just fell into the ship. That's not good. All right, I'm going to jump out onto the hull. Or try to. There we go. Yeah, the ship is totally on its side now. Well, this is a pretty eerie sight, just standing on the hull of an ocean liner while it's on its side and looking straight forward at the water, which is rapidly enveloping the ship. At this point, most of the interiors are underwater, and I think I'm going to jump off the stern now. So here we go. And there we are in the water. And there goes the stern of the ship going down, and I don't think it's going to go far. Yeah, it's about to hit bottom, and there it goes. So, Jay Killen in the Iowa has sunk the Conte di Savoia. So, um, yeah, and I apologize if that pronunciation is incorrect. Um, I had to look it up, and I'm not totally sure about it, but, yeah, there we go. All right, so here we have the Constitution, and it is actually still a ship that's around today, which is pretty cool. 
Now let's go find Jay Killen and let's take him out. So where are you? Um, I'm near the airport area. Oh, I see you now. Here we go. This is it. The final battle. Who will win? The Constitution or the Constitution? This doesn't look good for you or me. Actually, I might be able to get something here. Here we go. Okay, I have miserably failed. This is very bad. I may have given mine some rapid fire upgrades. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. I totally forgot. Oh my gosh. Oh no. This is bad. All right, I'm closing in. Oh gosh. Oh, this is bad. I'm dead. I'm gonna die. This is it. And there we go, folks. I am going down. Well, as my ship goes down to the bottom, if you guys have enjoyed this room, make sure you leave a like and a comment. And I'll see y'all next time, guys. Goodbye.